Welcome, foolish mortals, to the haunted mansion. I am your host, your ghost host. <laughs> Lol, JK, just wearing an awesome shirt. Hello inhabitants of the World Wide Web, how's life? So today I'm going to do something less creative, more jumping on the bandwagon, but you know me, I, I haven't changed much. So today I am going to do the Disney tag. I've not been tagged by anyone, but I will be doing tagging at the end, so... Let's go. A scene in any Disney movie you wish you could experience. Um, do you know what? I think I would love to experience the whole you can fly scene from Peter Pan because I've always wanted to fly and I love Peter Pan. So why not fly to Neverland to an amazing song? An unforgettable moment slash experience you've had at the parks. The first thing that comes to mind is the very first time I went to Walt Disney World. We went to go and meet Gaston and I didn't film it unfortunately, I wish I did, but he was very flirty and I, I wanted to kind of sass him out but he wouldn't say anything that I could sass him out to so I, I just spent the entire time laughing at him uh, and then I finally stopped laughing, stopped wobbling enough for him, for, for the photo pass photographer to actually take the photo when he noticed that I wouldn't look at him so he grabbed hold of my chin and forced me to look at him, that was quite funny. Uh, insert pictures here. I love Gaston. I, I mean, movie Gaston I'm scared of, but actual Gaston in the parks, brilliant. I love him. What non-Disney songs remind you slash brings back memories of Disney and all the parks? I mean, there's nothing really non-Disney that would take me back or remind me of anything because everything Disney, I've... <laughs> there's, not, there's no one specific song, really. I mean, if it was Disney songs, I'd be able to associate it with my Disney vlogs and would therefore be able to associate it with Disney, but there's nothing really non-Disney unless it's Sprite. There's nothing really non-Disney that takes me back to the park. When was the first time you went to a Disney park? The first time I went to a Disney park was Disney World Florida in 2014. Uh, we stayed at the Art of Animation Hotel and went for two weeks and it was pretty awesome. It was one of the best experiences of my life. If you could choose any Disney character to be your best friend, who would you choose? To be honest, I think I would choose Mushu for the comedic value. It would be good to have someone who cared a lot about you but was also incredibly funny so yeah I, I would love to have Mushu as my best friend. It also has nothing to do with the fact that I am Mulan. Nothing to do with that fact at all. Who are your favourite Disney princesses? Um, I think Belle and Rapunzel are my favourite Disney princesses mostly because they're very strong-willed, very out there women. I still think that Belle is one of the first Disney heroines because she was one of the first women who was actually strong and took control of her life and saved the day rather than um, sitting around like Snow White and waiting for her true love to come and save her. That kind of thing. But I, I can identify much more with Rapunzel. So either between Belle or Rapunzel. Name a scene slash moment in any Disney movie that never fails to make you cry. I mean there's loads. <laughs> um, I think the one that sticks out the most is, spoilers, Flynn's death scene. It's, it's really heartbreaking to watch because you've got Rapunzel who's trying and he doesn't want her to use her magic to save him so he ends up dying and then it's tragic. Pulls on your heartstrings, man, it makes you cry. What is the first Disney movie you remember seeing? It was either Dumbo or Mulan. One of the two. I don't know which one was first out of that, which explains a lot, actually. <laughs> What is your favourite Disney movie? You can't ask me that. That's like choosing which child is your favourite. You, <laughs> you can't do that. I don't have one specific favourite movie. I have like five or six. They are Mulan, Tangled, Fantasia, Peter Pan, obviously, Crike. Those are some of my favourites. I can't pick one specific one. Who is your favourite Disney villain? That would have to be Gaston because he is one of the most real villains out there. There are actual men like Gaston, so it's kind of, it's, it's incredibly scary because he doesn't have magic. He has words and a manipulative 
attitude and intimidation which is why he has so many followers and there are actual people like him out there so in terms of in, in terms of, of fear that's Gaston. What is your least favourite Disney movie? I think that's Pinocchio to be honest. I mean the overall message of Pinocchio is nice and that it's it's a beautiful beautiful film uh, like aesthetically but in terms of storyline you know Pinocchio just gets on my tits he really winds me up <laughs> he's he's very spoilt and self-centered and he doesn't seem to have much of a character arc you know the only reason why he's being good the only reason why he 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 does the things he does is because he wants to be a real boy and he's too easily swayed and you know, the whole monstro scene really freaks me out and there's also the animal cruelty scenes as well which I'm not a massive fan on. I mean, I don't think they were meant to be animal cruelty but you know, you kind of watch it and, and you see you see the donkeys and it's it's heartbreaking. I, 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 I cannot watch that film without hating it. So it's, it's gonna have to be Pinocchio. What is your favourite Disney song? to be Mulan's decision synthesized version purely I know when you say song you mean like ones that you'd sing along to so in that sense it's going to be out there from the hunchback of Notre Dame but my overall favorite Disney song Disney piece of music is Mulan's decision the synthesized version because it's just so beautiful you've got the under the undertones of the orchestra and, and they're there they're playing over under the sounds of this synthesized tune and it's it's just so it's the overall feel you get from it is determination and inspiration and every time I hear it I want to go and do something and 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 it's such a beautiful piece such a beautiful piece. What Disney character has your personality or has your dream personality? Sticking with the theme, Mulan has my personality. Or rather, I have Mulan's personality. Because the only person that I've ever want to be besides myself is Mulan. And I've always kind of modelled myself off of her. You know, she's a very determined, very loving, very honest, honourable woman, strong and independent and knows what she wants and does things that she wants to do. So Mulan. I am most like Mulan because I've forced myself to be like her, to be this strong woman who can knock any guy down who upsets her, who, who gets in her way, who... she's just... She is one of my idols. She is one of my absolute favourite Disney characters, Disney idols. And she's not a princess. If you could change any scene in a Disney movie, what would it be and why? Um, I don't know. I don't think I would. I mean, there are, there are like actual films that I'd like to change at, so that they didn't happen. But I, I don't think there's any one specific scene. Unless we're talking about Pinocchio and the, and the animal abuse scene. I think I'd change that just cut out the movie altogether or find a different way to get across that message. I, I, I think that I'd probably change that one. And finally, if you had to get stuck on any ride in a Disney park for more than 30 minutes, what would you want it to be? I mean, it's gotta be Haunted Mansion, right? I was stuck on the Haunted Mansion ride once before and it was, there was always something to look at. There was always something playing and I, I, I do very much love the Haunted Mansion ride, it's one of my favourites at the park so it would probably be the Haunted Mansion ride because you would never be bored, ever. Plus you have the opportunity to scare the hell out of the people you're with. So... <laughs> so anyway that was the Disney tag. I am going to tag Lugia Cross and Bethy Clyro. I hope you do it. Probably won't but I hope you do. Uh, and yeah! That's been all from me for now. Thanks for your time. Have a great day wherever you are, and I'll see you real soon. Bye! Hello, inhabitants of the World Wide Web. How's life? So we're back with my immortal grandfather. This video, obviously. From what I can gather, what little comedic talent I have seems to shine through when I do this video, so let's do one of those.
I'm turning into 